Hi, this is BV Ramana. Welcome to BV Ramana English Grammar. In this video, I would like to share with you the topic how to make the slow learners describe tree diagrams. Here, I am presenting the models of tree diagrams with regard to family relations, classifications, and classifications with other information. Here is an example of tree diagram with regard to family relations. Study the following tree diagram and write a paragraph about it. The heading of the tree diagram is the family of Ramana. Here the students may be asked to observe the picture carefully and write a paragraph about it. They may write like this. First they may give introduction. This is a tree diagram and at the second sentence they may write about the heading of the tree diagram that is it is about the family of Ramana. Next they may be asked to write the number of members in the family. They may write like this. There are 11 members in the family. They are Uma, Ramana, Raju, Rani, Delhi, Aswini, Janu, Jagadish, Divya, Gopi and Priya. Now students may be asked to write who's who in the family. First one, the head of the family is Ramana and his wife is Uma. They have one son, one daughter. Raju is the son, Aswini is the daughter. Raju's wife is Rani. Aswini's husband is Dilly. Going down further in the diagram, they may write like this. Raju and Rani have two daughters and one son. The daughters are Janu and Divya. The son's name is Jagadish. Students will also write like this. Dilly and Aswini have one daughter and one son. The son's name is Gopi and the daughter's name is Priya. Now relations among the members. How are the members of family related to one another? Look at this. Uma is the paternal grandmother and Ramana is the paternal grandfather of Janu, Jagadish and Divya. Here we consider the relations on father's side under Nanamma Tata. Now Uma is the maternal grandmother mother and Ramana is the maternal grandfather of Gopi and Priya. Here we consider the relations on mother's side. Ekada Amamma Tata Narda. Now the relations among the family members. How are the members of the family related to one another? First one, Uma is the mother of Raju and mother-in-law of Rani. Ramana is the father of Aswini and father-in-law of Dilli. Now Janu, Jagadish, Divya, Gopi and Priya are the cousins and Akajalula Anadamula Pilala. They are the grandchildren of Uma and Ramana and Uma Ramana la Manumalu Manumarandu. In this way, we can make the slow learners write number of sentences about the relations among the family members. Now conclusion. The concluding sentence is, it is a big or joint family. And the children may come out with any kind of concluding sentence. Now look at the example of tree diagram about only classification. And the Vargi Karana Gurinchi Matrame on a twenty, look at tree diagram which of them. This is the tree diagram about the classification of nouns. First introduction. This is a tree diagram. 
it is about the classification of nouns that is the heading of the tree diagram now about the classification vargi karana gurinchi there are five categories of the nouns they are common nouns proper nouns concrete nouns abstract nouns and collective nouns the common nouns are classified into uncountable nouns and countable nouns further classification the countable nouns are further classified into singular nouns and plural nouns in this way we can easily make the students write about the classification of nouns we can also write about the examples the example for singular noun is boy the example for plural noun is boys now we can also give a concluding sentence so in conclusion we can write like this the knowledge of the classification of nouns helps us in the matter of english grammar the children may come out with their own conclusions here is another example for a tree diagram with regard to classification as well as other information here this tree diagram is about vitamins their classification and also it gives the information about the sources of vitamins and uses of vitamins now let us see how we can write the first one introduction this is a tree diagram it is about the classification of vitamins their sources and uses now the classification of vitamins there are six categories of vitamins they are vitamin a vitamin b vitamin c vitamin d vitamin e and vitamin k now we can ask the students to observe the picture and write the few sentences about the sources of vitamins there are different sources of vitamins eggs milk and butter are the sources of vitamin a eggs meat are the sources of vitamin b fruits and vegetables are the sources of vitamin c fatty fish and sunlight are the sources of vitamin d leafy vegetables and nuts and seeds are the sources of vitamin e leafy green vegetables and cereal grains are the sources of vitamin k like this they may write a paragraph about the different sources of vitamins when you closely observe the diagram it is clear that the picture or the diagram presents the uses of vitamins now we can make the students write the few sentences about the functions or uses of different vitamins like this vitamins have different functions or uses vitamin a is useful for good vision vitamin b is useful for healthy nervous system vitamin c is useful for immunity system vitamin d is useful for healthy bones vitamin e is useful for protection of cell walls vitamin k is useful for proper blood clotting like this just looking at the picture the children may write the few sentences about the uses or functions of the vitamins now the conclusion the concluding sentence may be like this the knowledge of vitamins their sources and uses helps us in the matter of our health the students may come out with their own concluding sentences so far you have seen how we can make our children write the few sentences about the tree diagrams with regard to family relations only classification and classification with other information if you think the video is very useful 
please subscribe to my channel tapping the subscribe button on YouTube. Thank you very much for watching. Namaste.